Businesses and government agencies face huge new challenges in information security. Attackers are working around the clock to steal your customer data, proprietary business data, cause business disruptions and damage your brand. Companies continue to struggle with limited security staff to get the visibility they need to detect, investigate and respond to incidents. They collect vast amounts of log data representing host, user and network activities. They also collect an ever-growing amount of threat intelligence data. These data sets are two sets of fingerprints. One set used to identify anomalous activities inside your organization, and the other is evidence of their activities across the Internet. Both data sets contain tens of millions of pieces of information called indicators of compromise. Security teams attempt to collect, evaluate, and compare these data sets to understand if a security compromise has occurred. However, traditional tools often fail to scale to make threat intelligence timely and relevant for their organization. Introducing Harmony Breach Analytics. Harmony continuously pulls threat indicators from up to a year's worth of your security log data and looks for matches in tens of millions of indicators of compromise in threat intelligence data. This unique approach creates a security time machine that constantly compares up to the minute threat intelligence data with log data collected as far back as a year ago. This shatters the 200-plus day attacker dwell time exposure window often cited in security research reports. Suddenly, your security team knows what threat intelligence data that is relevant to your organization at any given moment. Harmony unlocks the hidden value of threat intelligence data for incident responders and security operations personnel. Want to know if company email addresses are in the hands of attackers? If data exfiltration has occurred, and identify connections to botnets and attacker-infected websites with a single solution? Get Harmony. Intelligence with relevance.